Why did you do that? What, was it an accident? I hope so. Okay, so here, what I have is, you know, flip-flops. Okay, I've got four flip-flops right here, and they're all together right here. But I'm going to put that right on the nail right here. Now, you can put your weight on there. Put all your weight on there. You step right on there. Okay, balance yourself. Okay, all right, this is fine. All right, now you can come off. There you go. All right, and there we go. And there, look what I have. The nail went all the way through, all, look, can you feel that? The nail is sticking out. It would have gone all the way through your shoe and probably through your foot. Okay, and that's not a good idea. So, so we don't want to do that. We don't want to step on nails. So if we take our body weight and we put it on one point, there's a lot of pressure. And that's interesting, isn't it? Pressure is not good, right? Well, at least not in that point. But you know what? We've got something better for you to do rather than to step on there. What is it? Oh yeah, well this is cool. Oh, we actually have uh, some nails right here. There's a lot of nails. These are, these are big old nails. What would happen if I dropped that on the nails? It would skewer my apples. So let's go ahead and do that. Oh yeah, I think it just stuck to there. <laughs> so that's interesting. Well, what we'd like to have you do, Tori, is we've provided something interesting. And my... How about that? Now, I have to introduce a friend of Pathfinders. This is Skip Lowry. Skip Lowry has been in Pathfinders for years and years and years. He's been on 17 mission trips all over the country and out of the country. Some of you have been to Oshkosh and saw the big uh, lighthouse. You see lighthouse with a... He built that. And it was also in Rhode Island at the big campery there in Rhode Island. And then it stayed at uh, Camp Elamisco until the last tornado took it out. So this is great. And, but Skip has built this for me. Isn't that awesome? Give him a nice hand. This is an awesome thing. Now, so what we have, what we have is a bed of nails. Have you ever heard of, uh, you know, the bed that has the number bed? You know, you can dial in your number, your sleep number. Have you ever, you ever heard of that one? Okay. Well, the sleep number is 1,500 on this one. There are 1,520 penny nails. Uh, that's all. So what we want you to do, Tori, is just lie down on top of them. Would that be a good idea? Okay. So right now, we're taking the, the bed and we're pulling the bed up. And uh, that's done by hydraulic pressure that you did very nicely. There you go. Yeah, just lie right down on here. We have a nice pillow, pillow so you won't hurt your, hurt your head. Okay. There you go. Can you move down that way just a little bit? Okay. And are you... There, there you go. Are you comfortable? Are you comfortable? Hello, Tori. Are you comfortable? Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. All right, so here we go, and all we need to do now is get the bed to go down, and then she'll be supported on 1,500 nails. This could hurt. How about a countdown? Here we go. Three, two, one, and she's going to get that bed to go down, and... <laughs> Tori, how do you feel? She feels awesome. Wow, is that a comfortable bed? Well, it's not very comfortable, but we're not putting holes in Tori, which is really good. Why? Because we're spreading out her body weight, all of that pressure over a very large area. And she's not being hurt yet. Isn't that right? That's right. You know, that reminds me, Pathfinders, you and I have pressures in our lives. They're pressures. Some of us are going through trials and temptations, but you know what? Remember the nail. You can't, you can't do it by yourself. If so, what's going to happen? You're going to get impaled with it. It's going to destroy you. But you know what? God says, look, I can help you. I can help you. Say, give me all those burdens. Give me all those pressures, all those trials. And then he puts people in our lives too. They give us support. Like all of those 1,500 nails supported her weight and she didn't get hurt. Wow, we have that kind of support. We can support each other. Hey, I'm thankful that God does that for us. And I'm really happy that you didn't get hurt, Tori. Good. Give both of our helpers a nice hand. Thank you. Oh, by the way, by the way, after lunch, if you're going to eat lunch, after lunch, after lunch, Alan Williamson said that we could open this up. You might want to get your picture lined on the bed of nails. And so after lunch, we'll be here, and you can come by, and you can take pictures, and that will be a lot of fun. Thank you.